a land of the Deku Palace, a young boy stirs. His name is Orson, but known to many, he is Link. He wanders, looking at his old kingdom, when people used to know him as a Deku. But then one day he was cursed by Majora, by the evil spirit known as Majora, and became a Deku, I mean, a, a human. Not wanting to be a human, he searched tirelessly for, for a way to bring back his old Deku self, but there was none. One day, though, they found, he, found, he found out that the evil mask salesman had taken his old identity and turned it into a mask. Even though, and although Link will never be able to truly be human again, he still carries around this mask to remind himself of his true form. That's pretty crappy. Anyway, this is Let's Play Majora's Mask again. Oh god, I was sounded pretty loud and obnoxious right there. But then again, when do I not? Uh, <laughs> yeah, so, uh, oof, uh, yeah, we're going this way, I think, since when we last off, last left off, which was like four minutes ago. Um, yeah, we're trying to get to the outer gardens, I believe. To get to the cage to release the monkey to bust him out of jail because I'm in because I'm in league with them monkeys mate <laughs> got him what's through here all right oh I from why did I think this was the door uh, oh shoot I need the um beans don't I beans the monkey said beans I get the beans somewhere if only I could remember where oh my god where are the beans Guys, the bean troubles my hand. Uh, uh. Alright, so let's go through here. There we go. Progress, man. Where's the secret garden again? I, I kind of lost myself. Oops, sorry. What did that say? Uh, Temple of Waterfall takes shortcut from Deku Palace. Waterfall. Huh. I think Windfall Temple is the, uh, the Woodfall. That's the bird. That's the fucking bird. That is the fucking bird of Ocarina of Time. Well, life isn't worth living. Um. Uh, I forgot what I was going to say. Oh yeah, I guess that's the temple for the, um, actual level. Foolish monkey again. Of course I enjoy seeing him. Why would I not? I'm going to talk to him again, see if, uh... What happens if I go sneak around? I'm just going to test that from... Get the fuck out of the way. Yeah, I just went to go see the monkey again. That's why I'm about to turn right. What does it say? Inner Palace Garden. Alright, so he can't see me right now. Stealth mode. Stealth in this game, luckily, is shit. Quite flawed. I'm gonna wait for this guy to pass by. Gotta hide in my shell. I'll never suspect an acorn to be an acorn. Just give me magic beats. Come on, get in there. Get in the hole! What is this place actually? Oh, more magic bean slots. Wait, sorry. 
Somebody tells me that was bullshit. What did that, what does that say? Sorry. Take you out, your fresh spring water home with you. Um, does that mean... Ah, damn it, I don't want to do that. Stop being retarded. Water. Spring water? Pour it on whatever may need it. What can spring water do? Uh, and do much. I'm gonna keep more spring water anyway. Because I have a feeling it might help grow the magic beans. What's up here? Oh! Magic bean cellar! Yeah, I do need magic beans actually. One free sample. From whatever you want, but if you don't water them, their leaves won't grow. Ah, I knew it! Yeah, I'll buy. Did I just buy that for 100 rupees? Oh, I think I bought it for like 10. Whatever. I'm gonna go plant the magic bean right here, even though it's probably not gonna do anything. Uh, I just wanna see how it works. I'd be human, don't I? Uh, there we go. Oh, look how pathetic it looks. Let's pour some water on this poor soul. Splish! Oh! And it's, uh... Where's this taking me? No, 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 no. I can't go. I can't go now. Oh, okay. Oh, uh, there's a chest over here. <laughs> I was gonna be like, no, I can't leave now. I still need to get more water. Yeah, that, anyway, magic beans are pretty awesome when you think about it. But just just for a uh, disclaimer, don't ever accept magic beans from strangers off the streets. Because it's usually a rip-off. I think I saw a movie once where there was like a kid who had to get medicine for his mom. So he had money to go out to the town or whatever. And a stranger offered him magic beans. And he bought the magic beans and wasted all their money. Everyone got mad at him. And I think later on, like, the magic beans helped him. <laughs> uh, maybe remembering that completely wrong. But I do remember something about magic beans. Hey, sup, bitch. They took away my water, I'll be sad. Okay, good, they didn't. I'm just gonna transform back to my true form right in front of your eyes. Alright, so this way. This leads to the secret garden with Colin. Uh, something tells me I should have gotten more magic beans. They're pretty useful, but I have to go back down there for spring water anyway. Hey, speaking of which, I got a free bottle from that uh, weird witch. Speaking of wi witch, hey! Ah, oh, god, I'm terrible. You know, it's it's impressive for a flower to even grow that much when you first plant it. I wish all flowers did that, because then you'd see immediate results, and then you'd say, like, oh, this isn't interesting anymore, and then not care about it for, like, 20 years. And then when it's all withered up, you'll be like, why can't I have nice things? Oh, was I on top of that thing? Don't, don't leave me. Don't. Ah, okay, don't worry. No worries. Ow. What are you doing here? You're just there to ruin my day. Okay, let's go. Oh, where's this gonna take me? Just up? Uh, <laughs> that was a good climb, like... Valiant effort. Oh, we can't get from here, okay. Oh, fine. Okay, I thought I was way gonna overshoot it. Let's try flying. Also... Oh, I thought, okay, I thought I would be able to kill him. Ah, there we go, he's dead. I love murdering things. Okay, let's fly that way. Oh, I'm getting pretty good aim with this. This is actually a pretty sketchy scenario, by the way. Uh... That's not good. Shit, no, 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 Link! You dumb shit! Hey, you know something I completely forgot? I mentioned in the last episode that I would like questions from people. 
Now I wrote down four example questions. Uh, just uh, as examples. What else do you want from me? Anyway, that you may ask, but I don't think anyone's gonna ask these any, any ones any particular anymore. Okay, so question. One of the questions is, what are your opinions on? Fuck. I dropped the paper. <laughs> what are your opinions on? Did that day just end? What are your opinions on the president of America? Well, fellow Morgan, um, the president of America is pretty badass, and not in the sense that it's funny, in the sense that he's actually not a bad president. I, I don't know actually though, because I don't live in America. He's not as, I mean, he's not as bad as George Bush. So basically, anything, anything which is better from George Bush is kind of my approval. But I'm not even sure if George Bush was that ab ab abominably bad, because again, I don't live in uh, the United States, I live in Canada. Uh, what do you look for in a video game? Okay, so I may piss off a few critics here, but the thing I look for immediately in a video game before gameplay, level design, story, practically anything, it can be the best game critically that you could ever see in your life forever. But the but with but the only but I will um but I will never enjoy a game which does not make me feel an emotion like an emotion which I don't regularly feel or make me feel emotion very strongly which I enjoy or I, sometimes I don't have to enjoy the emotion if the enjoy if the emotion though is heartwarming or <laughs> in some way uh, fit the tone of the game then that means it's succeeded that's why I don't like casual games because if you play something like Tetris you're not really feeling an emotion. Other than maybe Triumph, if you're, uh, if you get a Tetris, but no one really, but if you, I mean, I mean, some people may enjoy Tetris because they feel Triumph when they win it, but not me. Most casual games, I don't tend to feel that great emotions. So, that's what I look for. That's why I like games like, uh, Ace Attorney, where you feel, um, you feel very, uh, achieved that you were able to point your finger at somebody and yell, OBJECTION! And, um... Also, Shadow Colossus, where it's a quite a sad tone of game, and you also feel um, rather uh, rather uh, excited when you're on the sh Colossi and murdering it, and it's like a puzzle, and you feel clever, and it's that good. Um, another question I have over here. One second, I'm just gonna. Okay, <laughs> I hope I. Thank God I didn't uh, press A too quickly, because there's Deku shrubs on these, and I didn't know whether or not there was gonna be one of these guys on the next one. Want hit him? Okay. Uh, who is the Jolly Green Giant? I'm not sure if I have any videos which mention the Jolly Green Giant anymore. But the Jolly Green Giant Giant is essentially Daniel, the uh, the one, the real Daniel, the one Daniel, the best Daniel. Uh, he's a man of many talents involving uh, cooking and uh, dubstep and I don't know. But in real life, he's actually quite talented. As it would turn out, and he's a good friend of mine. And we like to do videos together, because it was our idea, kind of, to share. I mean, it was my idea for the gaming videos, which I do. But it's kind of our idea to grow popular and earn a fan base and stuff like that, because that's kind of our goal. Oh, I actually made it. That was not bad. That's not bad. It's still the first day. My deck of King's Chamber. Okay, this leads, this busts them out. If I screw up here, then fuck. Keep saying that, kid. No matter how many times I say, it's not going to bring the princess back. If they're not careful, the princess will fall victim to the monster. But I say, I'll say nothing more. Do you punish me or do whatever else? What? I uh. Oh yeah, because I'm a Deku. He doesn't like Deku's. So okay, mom. Well. Um. Oh yeah, I have one more question here. One sec, I'm gonna pause it for this one. <coughs> Takes a lot of effort to do this. Anyway. What is your best Morgan Freeman impression? Oh boy. You know what I have to say about that is that whenever I try to sound like Morgan Freeman, I end up sounding like Cleveland from The Cleveland Show. But I don't know anything which Cleveland says because I don't watch The Cleveland Show. So I'm just gonna... So this is, so this is my Morgan Freeman impression. Hi there. My name is Morgan Freeman. I like to say that being Morgan Freeman has been a pleasure of my life, 
and I will continue to narrate even after I have passed to the spiritual world and joined the gods of Greek times. See now, you be the judge if that's more Morgan Freeman or more uh, Cleveland. I think it's more Cleveland, but I was trying to be Morgan Freeman, trust me. Can I, can't I talk to you? Okay, there we go. How did you get in here? Shh, they see you, they capture you. Uh, for your help. I'm terribly sorry. Just try to cut the rope. We'll talk after this. No good. I'm drop something that can make a lot of noise, like a lot of noise. Now that carries a long way. What do you mean? Uh. Oh, you mean my ocarina. It's not really that loud. Oops. A tiny thing. Oh. I do, actually. Oh yeah! Prepare yourself. I just remember that X, Y, and Z work. Anyway. Oh! I have like the huge Deku pipes. So work. Who are you? Okay, listen to me. I was trying to find out about the poison swamp, so I went to the Woodfall Temple above the waterfall. I'll well, become a monster later in the princess to capture by the monsters. So the Deku Kings thinks I kidnap the princess. He won't listen to a word I say. Now the princess is in trouble, so I must somehow hurry to the temple and save her. Do you understand my plight? I quite do, because I don't want to hear your plight again. So that mean so then that means you will go to you'll go in my place and save the princess? Yeah, sure, I do basically anything anyone tells me to do. Alright, I'll teach you the melody that was the temple. The princess taught it to me. You can't let you hear us, so I'll sing it softly. Okay, up, left, up, left, A, le right, A. Up, left, up, left, A, right, A. Oh, it shows here. Oh, whoops. Why'd I do that? Let's do this again. Fah! Am I, how am I actually doing this wrong? Maybe I should actually be holding the controller while I do it. There we go. Yay! Sonata of Awakening. I don't know, the songs in this game which you learn on the Ocarina of just don't seem as rhythmatic. Some of them do. Like, uh... I'm not sure. I mean, just a few of them. I can't remember what songs they are. But just the way the things you play on the Ocarina don't seem as to flow as well as they did in Ocarina of Time. A sonata of Awakening. This melody awakens those who have fallen into a deep sleep. Hear that? Well, he knows. It proves the foolish monkey to see the prince so he can enter the temple. The monkey punishment commence. Oh no! He's gonna die. Uh, fuck. <laughs> I just got confiscated. You better take the shortcut the deck of people use to get um, get to Woodfall Temple. Uh, you must hurry. If you don't, you will be punished by the Deku King. Uh, yeah, I'll get right on that, bro. <laughs> anyway, that's about does it for episode number five, I think. I think we're making good progress here. I hope. Uh, but I'm probably going to record immediately after, despite how tired I am and how much my ears hurt. I will persevere for you guys. Uh, maybe I shouldn't actually, though. Oh, but what will I do then? I should pause this. What will I do then? Because, I mean, uh, I mean, I guess if I really have to do all this again, then I'll just do it off screen. But I've learned the song anyway, so if I go, were to go back in time and save, I think I could just come back here and I'd have a full, uh, full three-day cycle ahead of me. And I'd be able to get to the temple. Anyway. I hope that's the case at least. Um, I'm going to end it here. So that I can accept your questions in the next episode. Hopefully. And I can rest my ears. So I will see you next time.